when you have a group of images with kind of a similar look or maybe they're all from the same photo shoot, batch editing your photos is going to be the fastest way to apply the same settings across multiple images. To begin, you'll want to make some edits to one of the photographs. With this image here, I made some basic edits to the tone and color. I'd like to apply these settings to all of the photos in the album. I'll press L to go back to that grid view, and I'm gonna show you the two different ways that you can copy and paste or sync your photos. So the first thing you can do is copy and paste the settings. I have this photo selected, and I know that because there's a blue outline around the image. I can go up to Edit, Copy, and now those edits are copied. Alternately, you can right-click over the photo, go to Adjustments, Copy Adjustments, and you can also use those keyboard shortcuts as well. Next, I need to highlight the photos that I'd like to apply these settings to. So I'll click on this image here, hold my Shift key, and then click on the image next to it. Then I'll right-click over the photo and go to Adjustments, Paste Adjustments. Now those photos have the same look and feel as the other image. Now let's go through the second method of syncing the image edits. I'll go ahead and activate that first image that I edited, hold my Shift key, and I'll select all the other images in this album. I want to make sure that the image with the edits I want to sync is highlighted in blue. Then I'll right click, go to Adjustments, Sync Adjustments. Now every photo in this album has the exact same edits. And if I need to, I can go in and make individual adjustments as needed. One of the great features of using Luminar AI when syncing image edits is that the AI tools will still apply intelligently to each photo that's synced. So for example, when using Enhance AI, it's still going to kind of read the photo and apply those settings according to what's in the photo. It's not a flat adjustment like other tools can be. Also, if you use one of the portrait tools such as Skin or Face AI, but you don't have a person in your photo, when syncing your images, Luminar will ignore those tools on your photo. You also wanna keep in mind that there are some tools that will not sync across your images. So if you need to make those types of edits to your photos, you'll have to do them on a one-on-one -on -one basis.